Right, so we are doing the second part of hydraulic flocculator. So on the second part of hydraulic flocculator, now we have different case. For the previous part, okay, the, the normal ordinary hydraulic flocculator, they have uh, basically the speed of water traveling from one channel to another and going to another channel to another until it goes out of the flocculation tank, the speed are the same. Okay, the speed is the same. Now we have different kind of speed, okay, for compartment 1, compartment 2, and also compartment 3. They have different speed, okay. So because of having different speeds, it will affect on the number of channels and also number of uh, the distance between buffers for every compartment. So by the way, for questions on page 49, it is not completed. So I would appreciate if you can write down this uh, blue text here, okay? So, N number of channels in each compartment of the flocculation tank from, sorry, example 2. See? So, we are referring to example 2. Okay, can I proceed? Yes, yes. Okay, thank you. Okay, right, so I'd like to show you what do we mean by we have different kind of speed in the compartment. So, if we look at this diagram, Okay, this is a flocculation, hydraulic flocculation tank. You can see one compartment here, and then we have another compartment, and then we have another compartment. Can you see that the buffers, the arrangement of buffers are very strange or very different from one compartment to another? For example, the first compartment, perhaps we may have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Let's say 10, okay, buffers. That means uh, uh, you have a very narrow arrangement of buffers and then for the second compartment it's a bit uh, wider compared to the first one one two three four five six okay six uh, buffer and then this one is even wider gaps okay one two three four five so you can see the the different size of distance between buffer this is what we call distance between buffer and hence okay the number of um uh, channel will be different too. Okay, for for this case, one, two, three, four. You have four channels, and obviously you have you go, you're going to have a different number of channels in this uh, compartment. Okay, notice that the length is the same. The width of the tanks does not change, and the depth of the tank also does not change. Okay, so this is. Uh, whereby we have different basically what we can say is every compartment they have different speed of water traveling in it 